bands, $3.99, one carat, $6.99. Two carat, three stone rings, $14.90. Thousands of gifts guaranteed to appraise for double. The Jewelry Exchange Tustin. For those struggling with addiction in Orange County, there's great news. Laguna Treatment Hospital is now Laguna Treatment Center. At Laguna Treatment Center, we offer an extended continuum of care that includes detox, intensive rehab, as well as residential. Laguna Treatment Center is the clear choice for those in Orange County looking to find lifelong healing. The staff here is very kind, caring, and are very knowledgeable about the disease of addiction. Don't just dream about a life free from addiction. Live it. If you've been hurt in an accident and you need results, call Sweet James. Here are just some of the recent wins for our injured clients. Call the firm that wins big. Call Sweet James. The hot, crispy filet of fish You either love it or you haven't tried it yet. It's yet another reason to love Fridays. Get a classic filet of fish for just $2.99. Ba -da -ba -ba -ba. NBC4 News at 5 starts with breaking news. Right now at 5, a rock slide in the Topanga Canyon area near PCH is forcing road closures. Good evening and thanks for joining us. I'm Kathy Barrett. Hi everyone, I'm Mikhail Medina in for Jonathan Gonzalez right now. Julie Dang right now live over the scene in News Chopper 4 with more details on this rock slide. Julie. It is just unsettling how many images like this we've seen in recent weeks with record rain pelting L.A. You can see this cavernous area now partially covered by a tarp. This is on the south side of Topanga Canyon Boulevard at the intersection of Grandview Drive. Caltrans is now reporting a closure in both directions along Topanga Canyon Boulevard here between Grandview Drive and PCH. No telling how long that closure is going to last as crews work to get this cleaned up. You can see a couple cars here turned around. We have seen half a dozen drivers in just the last 10 minutes who've tried driving southbound along Topanga Canyon Boulevard before realizing this area is now shut down and then turning around to check this out. Uh, pedestrians, of course, being warned to stay away from this area. Again, Topanga Canyon Boulevard closed in both directions between Grand View Drive and Pacific Coast Highway. We are live overhead in News Chopper 4. Back to you in the studio. Julie, thank you so much. Let's take you back live to Malibu right now from our cameras there up above. Uh, meteorologist Stephanie Olmo is here with her first alert forecast. This isn't a result of what's happening now, but what happened right. with the weather back a couple of weeks ago. Exactly. And so we'll we'll find that happening right after rounds of wet weather. It will be weeks. You know, we could be dealing with dry conditions, but that's still going to be a concern uh, with that saturated ground. So as we check out this live view here of Long Beach, we're looking great with that sunshine around and temperatures right now at 62 degrees. But this afternoon, I mean, it's a 68, so not too bad of a day. Temperatures right now in the lower 70s in West Covina, 68 in Ontario, 67 in Riverside, 62 for you in Lancaster, 64 as we check out the area there in Victorville. As we check out the temperature change map right now, running about four degrees warmer now compared to this time yesterday in spots like Victorville and Big Bear, as well as over in the area of Ontario, just about one degree warmer there compared to this time yesterday there satellite and radar. So mostly clear skies, just a few high clouds streaming right on in. We can expect some changes. However, as we head into the next couple of days, we'll keep it mostly dry, but I want to zoom out so I could show you what we have going on here. We do have this area of low pressure you see all the way in the Pacific that's inching its way closer to the pack Northwest already bringing some clouds there and also some precipitation. Now for us, that storm track remains well up to the north. We're just going to look at clouds. We're going to have clouds across the area as we head into tomorrow. So uh, we're looking at mostly or partly to mostly cloudy skies across the area and temperatures maybe a touch cooler. So what can we expect for tomorrow? More clouds around dry conditions. Temperatures will be in the upper 60s to low 70s. And then we head into early week. We head into Monday and Tuesday will be slightly cooler with a mix of sun and clouds, but a warming trend is on the way as we continue throughout next week. Details in just a bit for now. Back to you guys. Stephanie, thank you so much. Two people were killed in a crash over in the Baldwin Hills area. It happened just before three o'clock this afternoon at the intersection of Coliseum Street and La Brea uh, Avenue. News Chopper 4 flew over the scene where you can see one car flip 
flipped over another severely damaged there. It's unclear exactly what caused this crash. Five firefighters were injured while battling a building.